What is going on guys? Kevin over at Leg Bros coming back at you with another video today. We do have two packages here, so I'm just gonna open, I'll probably do each one as its own video. I don't remember what these are because I have like six packages sitting there in quarantine right now. <laughs> I don't know if I still have to do that, but uh, I do it anyways. I just wait for the packages to uh, sit there for a bit before I actually open them and handle them and, and whatnot, just, to, just in case. Never can be too careful. Looks like I sliced this bag pretty good. <laughs> so that's unfortunate, you gotta be careful. Uh, if you guys do see any of this stuff, actually, you know what? This is a Bricklink haul. So this isn't gonna be anything that you guys can buy because this is mine, it's all mine. <laughs> uh, it is gonna help, it is gonna help out for uh, things that you can buy in the store. And that is stores.ebay.com slash legbros, just for good measure. This was a giant order, I believe I spent like, I don't even remember. I think I spent like $300 at this store. Maybe this was a different order, I don't remember. But I got a lot of stuff, uh, as you can see. So let's go through this stuff, see what I'm ordering in order to hopefully complete some figures. We have uh, some of these Islanders um, horns. We also had another horn for a Ninjago fig uh, that I needed to complete uh, as well. And so we'll be able to use those. I need another one of these, because I think it's for this guy. He needs those horns. Uh, I need two of them. The guy only had one of them, unfortunately. So uh, I'm gonna need to find another one of those. Uh, he did have some of these for cheap, so I just picked these up, which were just the uh, the newer version clone heads, not the newest version, but a newer version. Uh, of course, some chrome hilts. Always you can use chrome hilts uh, that are in good shape, so that is all right as well. Uh, wow, we were growing chrome hilts. We might as well buy regular hilts <laughs> as well. Always going through those. Even though we have a drawer filled, it's never bad to have those spare. Uh, we also did buy some black and uh, uh, pearl gray uh, spears as well. Use those for all sorts of different things um, in addition. Uh, we do also have some pistols, and these were a couple different varieties. He actually had these pistols way cheap. These, some of these things, so many people are selling these for like four bucks, uh, which is definitely not not where I'm at <laughs> on that. Um, but he had some captain pistols in there. Uh, so I got the black and gray versions of those. And then I also got a couple of these as well because I didn't have any of those uh, types of pistols either. So picked up a bunch of those. In terms of headpieces, we have a whole bunch of the Sensei Garmadon. Um, we have some Wolverines. There's some black ones like on Jace uh, and some Kai hair. What else we got in here? Uh, Anakin hair, and then we have Palpatine and old school Luke, and then also some Lloyd, uh, or sorry, Zane hair, not Lloyd, Zane hair, and I think, oh, there's Lloyd hair too, that one's Lloyd, that one's Zane, that one's Palpatine, uh, for the blonde ones there, so a whole bunch of hair pieces that I didn't have a whole bunch of since I've gone through a lot of things, now that I'm done with that 45 pounds, I'm actually organizing them, and I'm actually able to collect and complete some of those figures, uh, and now I'm needing the completion pieces there. So uh, in here, it looks like we have a bunch of Ninjago accessories among some other things. So we have some of these, which are also Islanders, the other types of headdresses, in addition to these ones. Some of them use this, some of them use the, this one. So I had a whole bunch of those I had to complete. We did have some black visors. Uh, I got picked up some of those, some Ninjago kind of side helmet pieces. Also these little under helmet pieces. I got black and red, a couple of those. Um, some gold pieces there. Um, looks like this is just the solid black version instead of the ones that have the white striping on them. Boy, there's a lot of Ninjago accessories for figures, <laughs> I tell you what. We also have some solid red versions. As you can see, that one's different than that one. This one has the black on it, this one does not. Uh, so we had a couple of those. There was a gold version of the chrome Actually, I just needed chrome. I was hoping these were just chrome, not gold. So that actually might be a mistake from the seller. Uh, that would be unfortunate. I think I needed the chrome, not gold ones, but we'll see. Uh, and then also the uh, masks from Aquanauts, and also they are the head uh, headpiece of damaged Darth Vader, uh, which is, I think, why I got those specifically. So that one, I don't think there's anything else left in that bag. So as you can see, a whole bunch of pieces. Uh, we just got a zillion swords, or, or katanas, I should say, of all different types of all different times and genres and all that kind of stuff. Uh, I had no idea there were so many different types of katanas. <laughs> like, even just the gray has, like, four different types of gray katana, if not more, uh, which is ridiculous in my opinion. It's just crazy. It doesn't matter. Unless they have the uh, different hilt, like these are the square hilt uh, versus the octet 
pentagonal hilt, I want to say, uh, was the really, really old school ones. That is a big, pretty big difference, but other than that, who cares? Uh, we also got Grievous arms, so we have white arms, and we also have the tan arms. I just bought as many as he had because I have a zillion Grievous bodies, and those are useless without the arms. <laughs> so uh, I needed a whole bunch of arms. I don't remember which side. I think these were all, like, one side in particular, uh, which is unfortunate. He didn't have both sides, um, but I'll be able to probably complete at least a couple of figures with that. Um, in addition, we had some binoculars and some of these uh, gold crowbars. I probably had some of these somewhere, but... I saw them, they were cheap, so I picked them up. I put these with the uh, Uncar Thugs, I believe is what they're called. Uh, we did have some axe blades here as well. These are just the pearl dark gray standard axe blade that pretty much everybody uses, with the rare exception. Uh, he also had some Minecraft accessories. I was giving these out in the Mix and Mads party packs before I knew Minecraft accessories were the value part, the valuable part of Minecraft. So I was really bummed out about that <laughs> because I've been, I've been throwing random Minecraft stuff in mix and match party pack figs for forever. Uh, so I'm guessing those people totally scored with some things. But I needed some swords, so I picked up some of those. <clears throat> wow, we got a lot of stuff from this store. Uh, some of the dark red bandanas, and then also the black full bandanas. I needed a couple of those for some figures. Uh, standard pistols. I was totally out of reddish brown uh, pistols, so I needed a couple of those. And we have Wolverine claws. Those are always good. Have a whole bunch of Wolverines that need those. Uh, now the big bag of stuff. This was looks like it was all combined. He also had a uh, Cloud City Luke. Well, not Cloud City Luke torso or feet, but I usually use these and change the hips and call it Cloud City Luke with wrong feet <laughs> or wrong legs. Uh, but it, it still looks good. It's kind of a custom fig that I sell. Uh, still, still looks pretty decent. We'll pour this out because I don't think I think there's a lot of stuff in here. Uh, mainly, I needed a whole bunch of these because I have woo woos uh, that I needed to complete, and a whole bunch of. Uh, I usually like to include woo with all the ninjas, so uh, I had a whole bunch of these that I needed. I had like no hats whatsoever. Uh, in addition to that, we had some dark red, and then some of the newer version of hat as well. Um, some pumpkins for the headless horseman. That's going to be much needed as well. I had a whole bunch, as you can see, in this Scooby-Doo box. I have just a zillion Headless Horsemans. This one I just found recently, so I didn't have any of the headpieces. So I'll be able to complete a whole bunch of those, which will be really nice. Um, we had some of the pirate head cap for Ninjago. The old gray, some of the old gray knight stuff I found uh, on his store. So that was something that I picked up as well. Uh, we also do have some... Uh, Ninjago head pieces, anything that was really, really cheap that I was like, hey, I use that. I just bought just because I was like, might as well have it. Um, some Fort Legorado head pieces or hats, I should say, as the dark brown version of the new Ninjago hat. We also had two forms of the black helmets for the old school knights, since as you guys can see from the <laughs> previous uh, the blind bags, I've been getting a whole bunch of old knights and stuff like that. So uh, definitely good to have helmets for them to complete them. Uh, a bunch of black Hats, or wizard hats, I should say, as well. And then we have some Sauvage Opress headpieces. I uh, did pick up a couple of those. Looks like we have some silver versions of this hat piece as well. Came in a lot of different colors. Um, and actually, we have two different forms of the dark. This is the old school dark gray uh, night headpiece. So we have some of those as well. I don't remember how many of each. <laughs> I'll count them up and compare them to the list. Oh, I had this one too. Wolfpack Knight, or Wolfpack, I guess you could say, Rebel? <laughs> Renegade, I should say. Um, my favorite figure of all time. Uh, but yeah, I needed some of these because obviously I have a whole bunch of those now. Uh, I need to complete those too. And I think that is going to do it for this haul. We won't open up the other bag on this video just because this ended up actually being nine minutes long, <laughs> which is quite long just for a Bricklink haul. I did not think it was going to go that long. We have a whole bunch of these now. This was the one piece I never find when I find the Headless Horseman. So we'll be able to have a whole bunch of those in store, which is really cool. I think he has a different colored cape too, which might be a problem. I didn't think about that. We're going to need the purple cape as well. I have a couple of them. Like this guy just needs his headpiece and he's got a purple cape. Um, but some of these in here don't have their cape. So I'm going to have to find that. I have kind of like a uh, random color cape drawer so i don't see any dark purple so i might have to actually order some purple capes in order to complete some figures too 
That is a bummer. <laughs> I forgot about that. Uh, but comment below what your favorite piece was, I guess, of this. Uh, in addition, kind of what you usually order when you do BrickLink hauls. I love BrickLink for this very reason. Just getting specific things is something I can't do in my profession from picking up random lots. Looks like there's some hair pieces in there too. Um, but ultimately, it just it saves so much time. Uh, some old, actually, these are dark brown Anakin hairs I didn't see in there too. Some Sith Anakins I'll be able to make too. Um, so yeah, you just can't beat it. Just being able to target to specifically what you want. Uh, hopefully I get into BrickLink and just do minifig stuff only on BrickLink. I'm not going to do pieces just because I don't want to start that. I don't have the space. I don't have the time. So um, ultimately, hopefully this goes through. I'm going to be able to go through this and it's going to take a long time to put all this stuff away. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. Probably film another video, but uh, that's the behind the scenes secrets you don't know. <laughs> uh, I love all of you. Hit subscribe if you're new. Become a leg bro. We're pretty awesome around here. And I'll catch you on the next one.